Hi everyone, welcome to our new video. In today's video, I'm going to talk about child tax credit. So watch the video till the end and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. If you have not yet, press the notification bell so that you never miss another upcoming upload from us. For this year and who qualifies have to claim him and what are some of the changes we saw from the prior year because I think a lot of taxpayers are going to be caught off guard with not only the change in the amounts but the income limitations are the biggest variables here. So last year as part of the American rescue plan the credit was increased to either $3,000 or $3,600 per child depending on the age and that was up from and that was up from 2000 from the prior year so the credit used to be a thousand trump administration increased it to two and then the american rescue plan increased 2021 to either 3000 or three or 3600 so it's quite a large credit last year and the income limitations were much lower much lower right so if you made, you know, arguably, let's say, would refer to it as too much money, the credit started phasing out pretty early, right? So far this year, it's reverted back to the pre-American rescue plan amounts, right? So, so the trial tax credit now is reduced to the thousand dollars per child under the age of uh, seventeen, and there is no carve out for a certain age gap and so in other words it's just two thousand dollars per child it's not three thousand or thirty six hundred depending on the age of the child so last year again it was three or thirty six hundred and the income limits were much lower and last year we also had those advanced child tax credit payments which were quite annoying honestly because taxpayers were getting checks uh, cut throughout the year and then we had to recon reconcile all that at the end of the year and of course with the taxpayer actually got versus what the irs had in their system never matched so there there were a lot of errors on the returns were where both parties disagreed on who got what over the course of the 2021 year. So what do we have for this year? Again, it's $2,000. That's child tax credit, the advanced child tax credit, the, the refundable fortune. Those larger remain and change. Now the biggest change apart from the amounts are the income limitations, right? Uh... The full credit is going to be available to if you are a single filler with under adjusted gross income or if you are married filling joint taxpayers, it's 400k as long as your uh, modified adjusted gross income is under those amounts, you're going to get full credit for the child tax credit. When you go over that amount, then credit starts to phase out, right? Other qualifications remain largely unchanged right child has to be under 17 at the end of the year the relationship test you've got to meet this right so it has it has to be your child includes adopted children you can claim brother or sister niece nephews and grand grandchildren if they are you are dependent right the support test another big one obviously you know you got to support provide more than 50% of the support for the child they have to live with your special rules for divorced parents the non custodial parents and the custodial parents custodial parents could waive the ability to claim the credit and give it to and give it to the non custodial parent that's an option and they the recent test rights so the child has to be either a US citizen or national or they have to be in the United States as a resident alien. So a lot of a lot of things mean you know the same frankly the two biggest changes are obviously the amount and then the income limitations. That's really it's right so the two thousand dollars is the credit now not the three thousand so that's a bit unfortunate. Uh, that's it reverted back to the lower amount but the income limitations are significantly higher than they were in the prior year so that's also good right so a lot of a lot more people are going to be able to qualify for the full credit because the income amounts 
are so much higher but the credit amount overall will be less okay so that covers it for this update obviously